Hi everyone, today we're going to create a really cool procedural geometry nodes effect in Blender 5.0. You can use any model you like, but I found a nice sculpture on Blender Kit from Free Poly. You can even get a discount on the subscription through the link in my profile. Step one, setting up the base geometry. Let's start in the geometry nodes tab. First, delete the group input node and add an icosphere. We'll set the radius to four meters and subdivisions to three. Step two, converting to a density grid. Next, we need to turn the geometry into a density grid for procedural manipulation. Add a mesh to density grid node and set the voxel size to 0.1. At this point, the group output node will disconnect because grids require geometry. To fix this, add a voxelized grid node and connect it to a grid to mesh node. Step three, creating the procedural effect. Now, let's carve an interesting pattern into the geometry. Add a math node before the grid to mesh node. And set it to subtract. For the lower input, add another math node set to multiply. And set the second value to 1.6 to increase the effects intensity. Connect the upper input to a color ramp node and link a Voronoi texture to it. Change the Voronoi type to distance to edge and switch it to 4D so we can animate it using the W parameter. Reduce the scale to one and adjust the color ramp sliders to increase contrast. Step four, smoothing the geometry. To make the procedural effect look more polished, add smooth geometry and set shade. Smooth nodes before the group output. Part two is in the next reel. IG hates videos over three minutes.